My name is Emma Hull. I'm the Director of Programme Delivery with the Indigenous Fire Marshal Service. I'd like to say thank you to all the communities that have participated in our assessments to date. And then I know there's a lot of communities out there who want to do home safety assessments but have concerns around COVID. It's entirely possible to do these assessments safely. You can go into homes if the occupants are comfortable using appropriate PPE and physical distancing measures. But also you can use technology, either by video or by telephone and have the occupant walk around the house and either show you or describe to you the various items on the checklist. And that way you can still gather this useful information while respecting the needs of the occupant. We have a number of training courses uh, that are starting on February the 9th. And it's a series of 90 minute interactive workshops that look at the fundamentals of fire and life safety and emergency management. Fire and life safety really is a community effort. And so the more people that are educated and informed, the more knowledge and the safer your community is. It's really helpful for people involved in fire and life safety to have a common understanding of the frameworks and the language that's used so that then you can start collaborating together to identify the risks in your community and build a plan to mitigate and address those risks. Please visit our website and go to the events page and you can see all the different events that we have and sign up and join us for these free and educational sessions. Thank you so much. Stay safe.